What's up, YouTube? Gen Nation Scythex here with another video, another reaction. This time we have a new comedian on deck. We have Tom Segura, Funny Disabilities. This will be the first time we're checking him out on the channel, and uh, I'm excited to see what he has to say. Um, I don't watch him too much, so this is a, a, a new one for me. Let's get into this. By the way, um here we go by the way we do have a patreon and uh patreon will be getting early access to our videos probably about a week early and um some exclusive content that's just for patreon so don't forget to sign up so you don't miss out appreciate you you'll get a shout out on the channel as well and i get why you laugh at my physical flaws physical flaws are funny they just are disabilities are not but some are. <laughs> Most aren't. We know those ones, you know? Like if there's a 10K or a quilt, it's pretty bad. But. <laughs> the rest are up for debate. And if you're sitting here and you're like, well, well, well when is it ever fu -fu 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 funny? Well, luckily for you, I have three <laughs> examples. First, foreign accent syndrome. Some of you know about it, some of you don't. It's real. You can look it up on your way foreign out of here. accent syndrome? Some people experience head trauma. Not funny. But they wake up speaking their native language with a foreign accent. Very funny. <laughs> I defy you to watch interviews with these people and not piss yourself laughing. <laughs> Do you understand? Like a farmer in Alabama who's normally like, bup, bup, dip, bup, dip, bup, that guy <laughs> hits his head and is now like, eh, the tractor trailer, it, eh, it <laughs> ah, man, That's not funny to you, you piece of shit, really? <laughs> you piece of shit. The best case ever of foreign accent syndrome happened in the UK. Well, not only was it a British woman who lived her entire life in the UK, she'd never left the town she was born in for 33 years. She was in an accident, and she woke up speaking English, but with a Chinese foreign accent. Oh, my God. Did you hear what I just fucking said? <laughs> Do you now believe in God and his awesome sense of humor? <laughs> a British lady who her whole life was like, hello, it's a bit of a whiffle, isn't it? Like that. <laughs> now says, I have not had my conversation most of it over three years now. <laughs> First of all, do you know how hard it is to do that impression without squinting? <laughs> Secondly. Oh, man. If you're getting uncomfortable, like, whoa, he's mocking an Asian accent? No, she's white. This is fine. A white <laughs> British lady just happens to say, Will you like a cup of tea? <laughs> Tastes good? It's good? You want milk? You want biscuit? Oh, you want me to suck the dick now? I don't know. <laughs> She's a nice British lady. She can say whatever she wants. Now, if you're sitting in your seat right now and you're like, uh, 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 I don't think it's funny. Well, don't get your tits in a tussle. I got two more for you. So <laughs> let's go. Let's go. What about persistent genital arousal disorder? That is a fancy way of saying never not coming. <laughs> These are people that have orgasms every 90 seconds and they can't have jobs. Why can't they have jobs, Tom? Because <laughs> they're coming all the time. <laughs> it's not appropriate for you to be like, can I try on this shirt? And the guy's like, Fuck your shirt. I'm gonna wear my old shit. I'm not wearing your fucking shirt. Can you imagine? You're like, oh, we're out of orange juice? Or. Oh. Just bring water. That's too much sugar. I don't want any more of that. 
funny. Some people suffer from both of those afflictions. You know that? It's rare, but it happens. Can you imagine that? That like you just walk up to someone, you're like, oh, I'm sorry to hear about your dad passing away. And he's like, <laughs> that feels good. <laughs> <laughs> I made that one up. That's not true. But <laughs> that was cheap, but that was fun. Now, if you're still not on board with this, how this about an third. old, reliable one? You know, how about Tourette syndrome? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you've heard of that. If you haven't, let me tell you. When I was in fifth grade, my parents sent me to a new school on a Wednesday. I'll never forget. It was a Catholic school, and on Wednesdays, they had mass. So picture you're a new student at a new school, you don't know anybody, and the first thing you're doing is you're going to church. So I walk in, and the priest starts the service. He goes, name of the Father and the Son. And the kid in the row in front of me goes, fuck your cunt. <laughs> oh. uh -uh. <laughs> Nobody did anything. No one batted an eye. He just goes, Holy Spirit, starts reading from the Bible. Oh, man, I would have lost it. This kid goes, lick my balls. <laughs> Fuck you. I am laughing so goddamn hard. <laughs> but I know I'm not supposed to laugh. It sounds like I'm having a stroke. <laughs> I'm 10. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> I have tears running down my face. And finally, I'm able to get out. Oh, Can you know me? It's laughing. Oh, man. And the kid next to me goes, he's got Tourette's. It gets old. <laughs> Three years I was at that school. That shit never got old. That was <laughs> yeah. the greatest gift God ever bestowed upon me. And I'll tell you this. The greatest day of my life, up until the day my son was born, was the day we had a substitute teacher that year, and they didn't warn her about him. Oh, man. Your imagination is serving you correctly. <laughs> it was glorious. I watched a 10-year-old boy break a grown woman's spirit. <laughs> These poor substitutes, they don't know what's going on in your class. Oh, you know, where are you she going? Walked in. Somehow, they didn't tell her, and she's like, read chapter three. And then his ticks would build, meaning they would start small. So he would sit in class and be like, hey. <laughs> So she goes, what's going on? And we're like, oh. she doesn't know. <laughs> and then he, he would do this every day. He would take markers and paint his own shirt. Again, every day he did it, but she doesn't know about it. So she sees it. She's like, what are you doing? He goes, what do you think, bitch? Ah. <laughs> then he starts painting his face with the marker and she goes stop that and he goes fuck you bitch fuck you fuck you and she's like what's happening what's happening <laughs> and we go that's kevin why are you crying so much right now like that and she killed herself she's dead so oh my god <laughs> what she's out of teaching but she's she's fine so what the fuck that's so random. Oh, man. That was fucking awesome. Tom Segura. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's hard not to laugh at Tourette's when, when they're saying some wild-ass shit. It's just, it's crazy. Not appropriate, but it is what it is. It's just sometimes it's funny, man. Um... Fuck, dude. Tom Segura, well done. He's officially added to the list. If you guys have recommendations, let me know in the comments. Uh, like the video. We are on the road to 1,000. We'll get there with your help. All you got to do is subscribe to the channel somewhere down here and follow all the socials, and we'll appreciate it. We do have a Patreon started. Um, so if you want early access to our videos, uh, sign up to the Patreon. If you want exclusive content, sign up to the Patreon. If you want a shout out from us on a future video, sign up to the Patreon. And uh, we appreciate that. Donation. Thank you. We out.